Today I'm going to show you how to get this uh, pan and till system moving having the ECUHF receiver on the tip of a wing and only with one PPM cable down to the vector by using this little device which is called a PPM SBUS PWM decoder. You can get this decoder from uh, fpmodel.com where I got it but you also can get it from Hobby King for cheaper $9.73 something like that. Not expensive. And this guy is passing through here the signal to control the pan and tilt. In this case I'm getting only the pan because I have only eight channels available and I'm using already seven in the plane that I'm going to show you shortly and uh, only one left for pan and here's how it works one cable PPM from the tip of a wing to have no interference with the other tip of a wing where is the video transmitter so here is my uh, EC UHF receiver and I have set it up to 12 channels and uh, the mapping of the servos is like this so I have the PPM on the first channel on channel 1 that's where the cable goes from here to the vector and here is the vector and for the vector I have chosen the channel 1 for throttle ailerons in 2 elevator in 3, rudder in 4, the mode in channel 5, sub modes in channel 6 and the gains in channel 8 and since I have 8 channels available channel 7 is the only one that I can use for uh, the, the servos for the pan and tilt so I have only one servo that I can use and uh, the input is going to be SBUS I keep my um, EC UHF uh, receiver in the tip of a wing and I'm using a dipole there so for this I just use one cable that it comes down to here so this is how the board looks connected so I have the EC UHF input here PPM the SBUS going from here to the vector and this is the servo that is going to the pan and tilt right there and this is the device and this is the name where you can look it up in the internet I'll be using the GoPro Hero 3 black edition for this so I glue up uh, one of those fat, fast uh, couplings it's a great connector so here is uh, how she looks and I put velcro there to put the flying camera attached to the nose so this is how it looks with the camera and the flying camera on it. And I have the the vector working.
And there is the decoder with the lights steady and this is when it's working. I don't like that much that the camera is uh, that high above. However, uh, we're gonna try it and then if it doesn't work, we're gonna put it lower.